So, neodymium magnets. Now you might be wondering why I'm talking about neodymium magnets on a Mark II Golf video. So, sump plug. Now, I am putting a magnetised sump plug on the Golf. The reason being is it's a brand new engine. Engines require bedding in period. Um, so even though the bearings are all sat, all perfect, you're going to have some form of metal filings or metal particles, however small, micron-wise, being discharged from various parts of the engine, they end up in the sump. So the oil in the sump comes through the strainer, into the filter, into the filter housing, and then obviously goes into the engine. What I don't want is any bits of metal getting anywhere else other than stuck to this. So neodymium is because that's the strongest domestic magnet you can buy on the market, especially when it's attached to a shiny sump plug. So, how strong is a neodymium magnet? Well, that's pretty strong. So, what else can it lift? It can lift one of those easy enough. Is it strong enough to lift up a 13mm spanner? Yep. Hmm. Okay. Can it lift up a 24mm spanner? Mm, bit more. There we go. So, that's a big heavy hand spanner. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some metal filings in a little tub with some clear oil and then I'm going to stick this in the middle and film what it does so you can see the actual effect of one of these sat in the sump. So let's get on with that. Right, so there we have some iron filings. Just use a metal file and a bit of metal. So not a mass nut in there, but mimicking that this is a sump and that's the engine, that would be quite bad, but for the process of demonstration, now let's get some oil in there. So that's our mimicked oil, AKA vegetable oil. So what we do is mimic what the engine's doing running in. So you're running an engine in, thousand miles, blah, 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 drop the oil. I'll do that for a couple of minutes and then I'll pull the plug out. So the engine's running, we're draining the oil. Hopefully that will zoom in. There we go. See all the metal filings now stuck to our magnet. So that is in demonstration what these are doing to your engine. All those bits of bearing material are now stuck to our magnet. I'll take a picture of that just so you can see it better. But there we go. That's the principle of how these work. So I'll get that stuck in the car. And then, safe to say, I'll know if anything does start wearing away, it will get stuck to this. Cheers for watching.